Hello, I'm Sister Rose here in Los Angeles to talk about two films in theaters this week and one uh, movie that's straight to DVD. My first film is called Warrior. This is the story of a father with two sons and they're all estranged one from the other. The father, played by Nick Nolte very effectively, is a recovering alcoholic. Now he was a coach. His uh, one son returns home after many years, an ex-Marine, he wants to be trained to fight in a mixed martial arts event. Now his brother, who's a teacher, is losing his house, everything's falling apart for him, so he trains for the same event. They end up fighting each other. Now I'm not giving anything away here because this is even in the promo if you look for the, the pre preview on YouTube. But the thing is, this is a movie about forgiveness more than anything else. And in the end of the two brothers, one of them has to surrender to forgiveness. The question is, the violence of mixed martial arts is very intense. You'll have to decide if this is a film that you would want to see. But if you do choose it, it's very strong, if not a bit raw. The next film is The Debt. Now this is an action drama fictional story of three Mossad secret servant uh, agents from Israel who in the 1960s go into East Germany to bring out a Nazi war criminal. What happens is that they flood, flub it up and they go back home and they say they killed him. They really didn't. So they have to live with this lie for about 30 years. What, what this story is about, though, is not so much bringing somebody to justice for war crimes, which is valid. It's about covering up something and creating a national myth that's wrong and untrue and the consequences that this has on a family, on persons, and of course, a nation and society. This is a very intense film. I found it very interesting, but it's full of ethical and moral complications and contradictions that really are interesting to deal with, I think, um, if you want to talk about it afterwards. Now, my third film is it's straight to DVD, as I said, and this is called The Fifth Quarter. This is based on a true story about a young 15-year-old kid who's killed in a car accident. His parents have to decide whether or not they're going to donate his organs. Meanwhile, his brother, who plays football for Wake Forest, he gets a little discouraged, but he goes on to play in memory of his brother, and actually the Wake Forest team that year uh, it has its winningest season ever, and this is a true story. But I think more than anything, this is a story about organ donation and the benefits of doing that. It's very cathartic and very moving, even though it's, it comes down to a basic football film, but it's so much more than that. Thank you, God bless you, and I hope you'll join me next time for Looking for Seeds of the Gospel in today's movies. For longer reviews, uh, please visit AmericanCatholic.org or on FaithAndMedia.org.